Hey eBay, today I'm showing you a Pioneer CTW770 dual cassette deck. Uh, this is a very full featured deck and I'll show you a lot of those here in just a second. First we'll go ahead and turn it on. You see it has a nice display there with uh, the VU meter when it plays. Pop a tape in, you can see that. It also lets you switch between play count and the actual play time. We'll go ahead and stop that. Show you the record deck over here. This is also the deck with auto reverse, so you can play it. And if we hit the other play button, we'll play the other side, which is a nice feature. This also has uh, a couple cool seek features. It has this button here you see, it says rewind autoplay. If we were to press that, it, it would rewind the tape all the way back to the beginning of the side that it's currently playing and play it from there. And it also has the skip buttons, which work just like a CD would, only they take a few seconds longer to find the song. But you can hit next. It will fast forward, find where the next song starts. I think you have to be doing that while it's playing. <laughs> I forgot about that. Yeah, you have to hit that while it's playing for it to skip. Otherwise, it's just the fast forward button. But you can pick multiple songs. You see there, I just picked three. What it's going to do is fast forward until it finds three gaps and play the song from there. So it's a pretty great feature for a tape player. Something I wish I would have had in the 90s. It does take it a minute to get there though. And actually in that case, I guess it hit the end of the tape and then it switched to the other side. And now it's going two songs back from there. Definitely interesting, works really well. Has normal and high speed dubbing. Has Dolby B and C noise reduction. Um, as far as the physical condition goes, normally on a deck like this, I would say it is in good condition. There aren't that many physical problems with it. However, there is one big one, and that is it is missing the Pioneer sign that sat right there. Uh, it says Pioneer on the back, but there was like a little nameplate there that said Pioneer, and somewhere along the years it's gone missing. Um, it comes with the deck itself, which has a built-in power cable, as well as this uh, small set of about three-foot RCA cables. And I think that is about it. Thanks for looking, guys.